Howdy. Oh. I suppose it would help if I had my microphone in front of my mouth. Howdy. Um, my cats are not so different than your cats. Um, my cat Matilda, Tilly for short, when she wants water, she'll put her paw right in the bowl and she'll look right at me and go, meow, 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 And if she wants food, she'll put her her paw in her food bowl and go, meow, 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 They're not dumb. Not at all. Mm-mm. And if she wants to be petted, she'll, like, come up to my side, you know, here on the chair, and she'll go, and she'll, like, rub my butt, or, or the side of my hip, or my leg, and she'll be like, oh, you know you want to pet me. Oh, you know you do. Yes, you do. You want to pet me. Yes, you do. Which is fine. But she also does this in the middle of the night when I'm trying to sleep. She'll come out to my head <laughs> when I don't have a hat on and I have this crazy hair going on. And she'll come out to me and she'll like rub my head. <gasps> oh, you know you want to pet me. Yes, you do. Oh my god. Yes, you want to pet me. But you know what? I'd never trade my cats in for anything because they are so fun and funny. <laughs> oh, okay, I used to have a fake ceiling. Uh, not a fake ceiling, a suspended ceiling here in my basement. And uh, my cat Tilly, I found her at work actually. Or she found me, I should say. She was stuck in a piece of equipment at my job. And uh, the guys at my at my work said, "Hey, there's a cat stuck in this equipment," and I went out there, and my hands were the were small enough to get in her, in there and and bring her out. She was a kitten at the time. Excuse me, my allergies are like. Bleh. And uh, so I brought her out, and I put her down on the ground, and she followed me around for the rest of the day. So I was like, "Okay, I guess you picked me." So I brought her home with me and uh, she had well we took her to the vet you know to see if she was okay and the vet's like she's pregnant and I'm like Woohoo, she's pregnant and so um, she had seven kittens and we kept two of the seven kittens well anyways so we had the suspended ceiling in the basement. And Tilly and her kittens decided, you know, as they, uh, they weren't even kittens anymore. They were like a year old. They decided to go up into the ceiling and walk around up there. And it brought the whole ceiling down. It, the whole ceiling crashed down. <laughs> oh, yeah. Which we we didn't like the ceiling anyways. We we're gonna replace it anyway, but you know, <laughs> the funny part is we were standing down here when it happened, and you know, so Tilly came down first, and then her daughter Isabella came down second, and then Monsters part of the ceiling came down on our piano. <laughs> So it's like, dong, 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 dong. <laughs> oh. All right. I suppose you had to be here. I'm sorry. But, you know, cats are, cats are awesome. You know, I never thought I'd be a cat person. But now that I've had cats, I will always have cats. So, okay. I just wanted to share that with you.